if you are a returning subscriber so i have decided to finally do a home office makeover i decided to turn one of my spare bedrooms into a home office that i can use to film videos and do other stuff i wish i had started earlier i regret not doing it earlier <laughs> but you know what we learn and i'm Okay, actually a part of me is glad I didn't do it earlier because I know I wouldn't have had the vision that I've had now So this is gonna be on a budget. I Didn't buy anything that needs adding yet yet. I wanted to buy a chair but It didn't work out. So I'm still on the lookout for a chair So for this part, I'm just gonna start by cleaning up decluttering and then cleaning the space and then setting up everything that I need to set from my last vlog I haven't touched it <laughs> see procrastination ah. and then I have this watch I've had for quite a long time it's a maroon the camera makes it look great it's a maroon bad girl watch it's too small for my wrist so the batteries are not working but the battery is not working so I am not sure what to do with this watch whether to put it in a giveaway or just give it to someone else because the hand is really small so i don't know who to do what to do with this picture because i haven't found a frame for it let me just reduce the brightness so i haven't found the frame for this picture i had done a black border but it has faded into a grid so i'm not sure if i should throw this out or find a frame for it i'm not sure where to find a frame i think i'm gonna look at mr price not mr price mr price is expensive at pep home and see if they have some frames for it and then this i think i got it at making a noise i think i got this at builders if not checkers hyper and so i used most of this paper for another stand that i regret like there was no need i know the vision that i had but it didn't work out so i wish i had saved it for this table so now i'm just gonna try and take it out and hopefully i'll be able to clean the glue underneath this table I have had since 2015. I bought it at either Macro, okay, but I think I bought it at Macro in 2015, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> so it has been with me ever since and it is still doing well. It's a good size. So I'm just going to try and clean it up and see how it works out. <music>
you can probably tell, the glue is still on the table. This is just soap and we don't have water so I can't really rinse that out and I still need to check Oguti, how can I get rid of this glue over here because this is ruining my table so I'm going to continue with the rest of the cleanup and then I'll find a solution for this one later on. deciding what is gonna go where so this mirror I'm thinking of keeping it in the corner here I'm just not sure which direction it's gonna face because when I do clothing hauls most probably it's gonna face me so it's gonna be a matter of deciding where it falls I just need to clean it quickly and then the fridge that was here this is a bar fridge that I have had since my um varsity days so with this one it's gonna go home soon so i'm just gonna take it and put it on the other side where the table was because that side is too dark for me to use so i'm just gonna put it there together with whatever boxes and the things that are on top of it i just still need to decide in all these boxes because i have all papers and books that i don't use anymore so i just need to decide what i'm going to do with those books whether i'm going to donate to them or you know sit and set up the problem is this is a bit too big for the space it just leaves a small gap so I have to put it closer to the closet and I don't want to put it anywhere else because I like the view I like looking outside and the light from the window comes straight here so it'll actually wow there's so much noise outside I apologize for that the wind and everything so i'm gonna speak louder so it's gonna be easier for me to compensate for the light because i have um 
oh i have the light coming directly here and i can put the ring light anywhere i want to and then i also have that space to just do stand up videos over here it's gonna be sit down videos this setup I thought the rug would be in the middle of the room but I feel like it kind of looks it kind of it kind of looks awkward I hope that makes sense it's bigger than I thought it would be for the space um, I also wanted something for my feet to keep warm when I'm sitting at the desk so I just decided to push it further inside honestly I feel like it's dark i feel like it's too dark for the space at least but i with the rug i'm planning to buy it's going to be bigger than this so i don't know <laughs> i don't know my battery is flashing it's low i need to charge i'm gonna go and rest while i charge just so i can also think about how to remove this glue from this desk with the chair that I was looking for. Let me just, let's chill, let's chill. Let me see where I can put you guys so that we can talk nicely. Right, so, okay, it's not looking out. <laughs> Come back, okay. So, with the chair that I was looking for, this is the chair that I wanted. In the pictures online, it looks so nice. Like, I couldn't stop thinking about this chair when I saw it. I finally got a chance to see it because every time I tried to buy it, it didn't work out and I was getting frustrated with it. Like, I just want this chair because with some vendors, it was cheap. Bird, please, can I talk? <laughs> with some vendors, it was cheap. But then when it comes to shipping, it was like, gafanamos. Like, it's, it's expensive. Okay, it's not expensive, but like, itur for me. And then um i like i kept on searching for the chair and i couldn't find it and then like this past week i saw that there's a lady that actually sells sales sells those chairs so i asked her to just come and quickly view the chairs and when i got to the place the chairs were small they were small like online they look big they look like your normal chair but they're actually small so i have to settle for the white chairs that I have been looking at. So I decided to search on things that I can use to remove the glue. And I found that you can use acetone, but I don't have acetone and I couldn't find my nail polish remover. So I remembered Uguti, I have this thinner. So this I have this thinner from uh, a paint job that I did. It didn't work out then. So now I started using this and it works. It works. I'm hoping it doesn't um, <laughs> ruin the paint job off the table. It smells strong, so that's why I have a mask on. I'm just using this sponge to remove the glue, and it's working so well. Oh, I'm a happy girl. <laughs> But my table looks new because that thinner has some oil in it. Um, it left an oil film on top of the table and it did not ruin the paint job, which 
I am so grateful because now it looks brand new. Although gunuga e paraffin, I still feel like I like it. And obviously, as the room airs out, it's gonna clear. The smell is gonna clear. Okay, so I've put in this black folding chair over here, and with the total look of things, I have decided to go with the white chair. makeover so i spoke with the lady that's supposed to sell me my chair listen i made an appointment with her for 11 to 12. i get a message at past 11. she says she's in brits which is a whole other town from rustenburg i was very angry on the inside because i was really hoping that chair would have been here and I would have been doing the finishing touches in my office. So I just felt it down a little bit and then I took some time off from all of these makeover. I also went to Pep Home because I decided not to throw away this uh, picture. I decided to save it and then just buy a frame for it. So I saw a frame for 55 rand, 54.99. And then I also saw this mirror. And then I decided, which you know what, I'll just take this mirror, which is 30 rand, and just remove the box and the mirror inside, and then just use the frame. It's not going to work. Damn! <laughs> Why didn't I think of it? The glass. I don't have any glass to put on top of the the picture. I was so sure that it was going to work. Damn. I liked the frame of this mirror. As in, let's see how far we get. So casually keep diving into concrete. just missing the glass on top but it's not bad and I was planning on hanging it like somewhere like here but like this the problem with these nails is that I put on I put in very small thin nails so that they don't do too much damage to the wall and they are too loose so it will fall because the mirror is too heavy. Okay, I think for now, I'm going to settle for that. Because since I'm renting, that's the only um, risk I can take. I decided to switch the two because that one actually fell out. And so I just put them over here together. And it's not that bad, actually. I wish there was a gap here. And I can't move that because I made the two um hooks especially for that one so i just need to fix those over there
finally managed to get the chair so this is the white chair i was talking about and it has um wooden legs so i just still need to get it out of the plastic bag and then um put it where i needed to put it so hard to please With your colors They kind of tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Stay We fly around like paper planes They never know where we will fall Nobody can see us Still they wanna tear us apart There's something different about the way we are Cup after cup Yeah, it's just the way we do it Anything just to block out the real life Real life Yeah, we're loving the way they Think we're so messed up uh -huh. And that is the end of my office makeover On a budget I only bought two things Which is that mirror that I turned into a frame and that white chair that white chair i ended up getting it at an, at an indian shop for about 350. the lady was selling it to me for 400 rand so i'm really disappointed that she didn't sell it to me because i was hoping to support her and not go the other way around but unfortunately things happened and i just wanted <laughs> the chair and i'm glad i went out again to look for the chair because i like how it makes the office look it looks it looks nice it's just a different touch to the office that the black chair didn't add so i hope you guys enjoyed this makeover i will wrap things here if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe also hit that notification bell button to be notified every time i post a video this is lana chalala signing out i will see you guys in another one bye